and we're going to possess plus plus as if one wasn't enough. So now we have, well, that symbol, whatever that means. Oh, possess. Okay. The okay, nice. This is finally where um, possess comes before normal moves. Yeah. So now I can't push it in because possess comes first. So I don't know how I'm going to deal with that. Um, actually, you probably just do this, cycle around, and push that block in. Oh, I can't do anything. Um, wait. Okay, there we go. So that will be the key ingredient for these puzzles, is the ability to use other blocks to push that other one around. Um, it seems hard right now. Um, here, maybe do that, and then since that block is inside the other, it can push. Okay. This might be a shorter one today. So, get that out of here. We do want to move them around. Yeah, okay. That's, that's not enough because the, you see, this is actually a block. Um, this is actually the bl the player on top of a block. So when I do that, it counts as a block on top, not the player on top of the target. So... There still needs to be a block on there. Mm. There we go, okay. Next one in the sequence, we have... Epsilon instantly. Let's probably not do some of that. One. All right. Maybe I'm not going to explain what Epsilon means this time. <laughs> okay. But still, we need an answer to how to do this, right? I probably want to push that out. Ah. Maybe the order is off? I'm not sure. Hmm. Possession comes first. How do I use that to my advantage? I can even do this and push that block out. Hmm. Now, don't I want this block up in the first place? I thought I had something going there, but maybe that thing shouldn't be the second one. We can just go here. It seems sketchy too, honestly. Like, yeah, because the whole point of doing that. Well, hold on. We maybe want to get one of the players inside there. That didn't seem that productive. Um, yeah, I don't know. So we could like do this and then put a block on, but we still need both literally on each other. Not sure how the the possession being first helps here. Well, does that count as like moving something in? Because now I can do that and push that. Oh, now the issue will be that. I can't... Huh. Was, was my goal just to keep something in there the whole time? Hmm. Because I'm realizing I have no idea what block should go on here. Like, is it the player? One of the better scenarios is if we could push the other player into that position using some block. Not Don't put them literally inside, but... Like, the other player wants to be behind what the the other block here. So you're going to need to make that happen. Um, but without that, okay. Ugh. How do I do this? How do I get this down now? Like this. Like, something like this. You see that? And now I can get in here and then possess that, and that would be, the, be how we end. Um, the problem, of course, is this block is stuck on the left edge. But other than that, that idea is perfectly sound. Um, no, that pushes it in too far. I don't think we can get away with it, but maybe we could. Yeah, I, I don't see. I don't see me getting away with it. Well, hold on. I can just put that in the target. All right, all right. Looks very good. There we go. All right. 
that wasn't even a challenge level, whatever. Um, that looks very similar, except what? Except now the block is there. Is there any other difference? Because that is, uh, that's pretty tough, isn't it? Where am I going to stuff it now? Just on the right edge? This, um... Okay, that that's something, right? So we want to go in there and push up. Now? Oh, no. What the heck? Oh, oh, no. I can't enter that block at all. I can't enter this either. No. Seriously? <laughs> oh. Okay, no, no, no. We put the blocks in each other. Okay. I was wondering if that would come up. Well, I, w I was obviously not wondering if that would come up before. Um, but now I obviously think it will come up. Alright, now that block needs to be elsewhere. Yes, I am resetting there. That block is actually kind of stuck to that. Um, yeah, now... We want the other... We want the blocks in each other. How is that going to happen? Without getting stuck in it, too. Like, you can do this. Um, ridiculous, because all we'll do is Epsilon. And we will have similar problems, but at least that's pushable. We still need to get it in the, in the position where we can just get the other player on the right side. Can I cause this now? Please? Okay. There we go. Okay. Look at that. What a nice twist on that one. Alright. Two more in the set. No, 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 it's not. It's obviously four more. Anyway, we have friend. Hello, friend. You, you're, you, I, this is not something in the main game, is it? Because I don't remember it changing like that. And the, not only that, but... The um, thing, thing at the top is also retained. Okay, wow. Okay, so now I push up. But since one of them is the friend, which is not moving at the moment, it allows that move to happen. Okay, so now we can win from there. That could go into some really hard levels. Um, okay, so this is the standard pushing behavior. The first um, move, I am pushing the... Uh, the first play is pushing the second, and then the second moves with my right move, with my right button key. Still, I do want to get that out. So, how do we do this? Here, right? This didn't seem to help that much. Okay, look, that seemed to be good. How do we move this for this time? Here? Alright. Uh, do we have to do this again? Hopefully not. Oh, okay, we're gonna have to do this, like, in reverse or something. Is it interesting that the property of being a second player is, like, part of the player that moves around? Instead of the block? But yeah. Alright, what were we doing? We wanted to push, and, like, we have to almost, like, swap the... Swap them. Unfortunately, people will get confused when I say swap, huh? No, it's just a meme. Um, anyway. That was terrible. We don't do that here. Yes, that works. Um, I'm gonna do that. Nope, nope. What is going on here? Um, why does this not work? Because I'm getting pushed or, or something? Hmm. Swap us around again? Nope. This is not correct. I, I should be pushing that block. It's not really working, though. No, the friend wants to be the one at the front, right? 
What? What is wrong? There we go. Okay, okay. We got it. Yes. Come on, we're so close. There we go. Then... What is that? I think we got enough eye symbols on this one. Anyway. So that is a block with a target on it. We can possess as well. Get that out of the way, probably. I don't know. Oh, jeez. Okay, so... Again, how many eyes need to be on that block? There's even a target one below it. But, okay. So now when I do this... So it didn't work before when I tried to go up. Well, it did work, but it just... It's not really anything that makes progress. But now when I do this, it's not a possess anymore. It's an eat. Okay. But we still need to block on that bottom target, don't we? So... And put that out of here, which is a good thing. Um, oh gosh, uh, we... that's like only one of them should be dealing with this at the moment. Maybe somebody should be eating the bottom block. I'm not sure. Like the point is that oh, ah. we need to press up from here. Such that they can eat each other. Did I mess up? Okay, let's uh eat the player. So now that's like a block. Fuck, oh, this is really cursed. Um on top of the target block, which is containing an unpossessed player. So now I can press up and win. Alright. Last level. In possess plus plus. Okay, so <laughs> we're gonna uh, challenge level everyone. Um, that's why you don't make super small levels because you have no idea what just happened and still solved it. All right, see everyone. Okay, like I still managed to do this by accident the second time. Like, yeah, I don't know. Um. Like, I got two possessions to happen in a single turn. And then I w went into the, uh, into that block. Actually, no, it's because I pushed the friend in, and I just normal possess out of here. Okay, anyway, bye.